Thank you for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing right now. This is the view of my home office that everybody usually sees with the ticks clocks behind the 30 inch monitors and of course my chair, a Grawl Synchron 8. Grawl no longer makes those chairs. And then the audio is coming out of the Samson CO1U. And behind there, there's not much. There's like a USB hub, my wireless digital picture frame, an external hard drive. If I take a step back to provide a little more perspective, you'll see that on top, there's a lamp that shines down when I'm doing videos in my chair. And then behind it, you'll see the top of the center speaker. What you don't necessarily see laying on its back is a LED message board. And the reason why I'm giving a tour of my home office is because people keep asking. Now, behind my desk, there's actually about a foot gap between the desk and my wall. And this is the reason why. <laughs> all the cords, all the clutter, the UPS, my connections, then of course, the computer itself. It's actually a small computer, a very quiet computer. Now over here is my closet, which Ponzi says is way too organized. I disagree. I've got uh, extra media in there, software, drawers with different components in it, like cleaning materials, USB cables, USB devices, CDs, uh, network cables, uh, some manuals, uh, various computer components, etc. And of course, on top, the shelf or shelving units with tools and some extra hardware. Speaking of... There is my collection of PSP games and some DS games. Yeah, look at that. Oh, yeah, that's where I keep this. And guess what cartridge is in there, baby? As I break it, let me open it up here. Guess what this is? That's right. I told you I was a Tetris addict. And it holds true. This is the computer that is running the live stream. That is a Mac Mini. And above it, the keyboard, the wireless keyboard. Below that is the collection of locker room paraphernalia, including hats that are no longer in production. Very limited edition, the only two that I have left. A uh, few random CDs. As I want to listen to CDs, I bring them upstairs, and then down below there, the subwoofer. The Mac Mini doesn't have a monitor. It uses, that's right, my plasma screen. I have it a DVI going out into HDMI, a great image quality. Uh, so I don't have to have a monitor for the Mac Mini, I just use a television. So this is what I'm running the live stream on. The chat that gets captured in the video is actually this. So you should see the same thing uh, happen as people are chatting. See? See how it works there? Pretty cool. I take a step back here from my entertainment center. You'll see the Xbox 360 webcam. Oh, there's the uh, mouse for the Mac Mini, by the way, in the middle. And then down below, a Comcrap DVR and a regular old Xbox 360 with a 120 gigabyte hard drive. Obviously the Xbox 360 power supply. Well, we're staying down here. Show you I got a few more CDs and some PC games. And then down below, even more games, including original Xbox games. Here, I have a shadow box. In the middle, there's a dollar bill. But on there, you'll see that I, uh, defaced it by typing, or typing, oh my god, by writing in Sharpie the number 10 million. And the reason for that is, well, one of these days I'm going to make 10 million dollars. I don't know how, but it's going to happen. And that dollar bill serves as a reminder that everything I do is to build that to tw 10 million dollars. So I'm, that's my worth. I'm, I'm worth 10 million dollars, because I say that. Uh, my Xbox 360 games, and a couple of LED puck lights, I love those things. And then this is just a, a coaster that I had nowhere else to put. Uh, some DVDs that I have here, including some Christmas DVDs, etc. I'm going to take a step back again. 
Up there is uh, the Canon GL2, which I'm likely going to be selling, uh, and a speaker in the background for the, uh, the television. I, I don't don't really have an entertainment true entertainment center. It's good enough. That camera is what you see from a distance when we stream live. And then over there is just, well, another plant to match that one. Uh, as I turn back towards the entrance of the home office, across the hallway is the bedroom, which I'm not going to show off. Got a little stand with the Fantazine, a digital picture frame, cologne, yada, yada, yada. Short little black bench that opens up. Doesn't really have anything in there now. There's a, or a I guess it's, it's not exactly a rug. It's more like a mat that Ponzi can't stand. We've got a second desk here. Haven't really decided what I'm going to put over into that area. And then, coming around here, even though you're not probably able to see what's going on there, it's a bunch of gadgets and gizmos on two different shelves. Uh, that's where I keep things like uh, extra players, GPSs, audio equipment, binoculars, cameras, robots. And down below is just a different set of uh, gadgets. Oh, that's a bamboo. I've got three bamboos. This is, again, part of my desk. PSP, Nintendo DS. In the background there, it looks familiar, is the printer, scanner, fax, telephone on the little stand. Ah, starting to look familiar again. Yep, that's pretty much what you see. That is pretty much where I live, in front of the computer, or behind the computer, depending on how you say it. Oh, I guess this, this was a behind-the-computer tour, wasn't it? Behind the home computer office of Chris Perillo. Well, if, uh, if you thought that was fun, cool. And if you know of things that I could use to fill up this home office, I am interested. I have got to get things to put in this home office. I've got to fill that closet. I've got to fill my shelves. I've got to fill every possible space with tasteful objects. So if you have any ideas for me, uh, well, you can email me, chris at perillo.com. Or maybe you have a company that has, uh, you know, cubicle things for sale or office things for sale, and you have some ideas, let me know. Oh, by the way, I forgot. I've also got a uh, footstool over there, and the reason why I got that is because when Wicket puked on the MacBook Pro, it was sitting on the floor, and so that's not going to happen again. <clears throat> well, at least not on the floor. So uh, anyway, uh, you've got my email address, and if you want to join the chatters and watch me streaming live from my home office every day, all you got to do is go to one website, and uh, they're telling you right now, even though the channel is moderated, uh, it's at live.perillo.com. We'll see you later.